Hey, welcome back to Let's Play Aversion. We're now going on to World 3. There we go. Now, like I said, you can leave at any time, and it doesn't matter. Now, it started off us off in Dimension 2, as you can see in the upper right. Now, these smiley faces, you hit them underneath, and they release a gem, and it'll stay out even as you switch dimensions, but if you die, they go back in. So you don't want to die. Now, now I'm in Dimension 1, and I can only go to Dimension 2. And the Portal Dimension 2 is here, but when you're in Dimension 2, the Dimension to Portal 3 is right here. Now you do kind of the same thing here. This is this level's kind of like to get you used to dimension switching. So we've gone to Dimension 3 before, now we're going to go all the way to Dimension 4. This is at the start of where the game gets a little bleak. The clouds are gone, the trees are gone, the plants are gone. You can still hit these smiley faces and all the enemies have lost their legs and can no longer move. So let's get all these gems that I hit. Oh, also blocks are now have cracks in them, so you can jump and break them. So that's useful. So right now, like I said, we're in Dimension 4. The only... Um, the the, the main th reason you might want to go back to Dimension 3 is because of the clouds. But also, I want this enemy right here, a little more, to walk a little towards the right so I can bounce off his head. Okay, I think we're good. See, now he's a little more to the right, and now I'm going to bounce off his head and get over here. I think the, the way you're supposed to do it is you're supposed to jump up those blocks, but this way I find it's a lot easier. You can also jump from here to here for even more goodies. I'm sure there's real ways you're supposed to do this, but I found this is the easiest way, so that's what I'm going to do. Now here, you can switch back to Dimension 3 in order to hit this block, and now you're going to wait for this enemy to go all the way to the right so he's out of the way. Okay. Now we can go up. Oh, drat. Yeah, the the jumping when there's only one block in width is it's a little too precise. I have to be standing, you know, in the exact right position for it to let me jump. Like right now I'm hitting jump and nothing's happening, but if you stand just in the right spot, that's okay. Like I said, because I died, the thing went back in the block. So I have to hit it out and then then go up to it again. Okay. Yeah, like I'm trying to jump here, but it just didn't want to go until I was exactly right. Uh, I did miss. I couldn't remember if I missed any. I missed those two, but they're pretty easy. So now something bad happens. The world starts to dissolve. This happens in two levels. So all you got to do is just run from it. Best way is to go that way. Now you want to bounce off this enemy and then you can get all these gems here. And then that's it. That's the end of the level. Just gotta get past all these guys and that's world three. So now we're gonna go on to world four. Things get... You're like, oh, it's another happy level. Yeah, when you hit this block, we go to dimension five. Dimension five is even worse. You can no longer hit these blocks. Every All the plants are dead. And the enemies now can move once again. And if there's ever a gap of water like that one, most likely there's going to be one of those hands coming out to get you. So you got to be careful. Now luckily, as I'll show you here, the bottom half of the hands are safe. It's only that red part that's going to kill you. So, oh, that's okay. It saves the gems you got. So you can do some hard gems and then just die and it'll save for you. So now we get those, we get those. Now these are hard. You have to shimmy down and then go back to the right. Okay, here we go. Ah, got it, and got it. See, now I can kill myself. Oh, I didn't mean to. But it saved that I got those gems, so I don't have to do that again. Now here's the tricky part. That hand comes out. 
Now here's a really hard one that I might die on. Okay. I got it. Now this is the this is the check mark for the level, so we're good. Now we have to get across this. Okay. Now here's a really hard part that I usually die on a lot. I have to jump out. Oh, I got it. Okay, another little shortcut you might want to take after getting this gem. Oops. Darn it. Well, now I got the gem. I don't have to worry about it. Yeah, you can jump over two of them. No. Okay, a little shortcut you can take is bouncing off this guy and then bouncing off that guy and jumping over. Uh, it's going to take him a while to walk back, so I'm just going to... Now, if you want to go back to the uh, Dimension 4 to hit all those, the, the little teleporter is right in here. So, we want to go to... And there's the end of the level. But we want to go back... We have to go back to the level. Oops! Drat. That's okay. We want to go back through the level to hit all those spaces to get all the gems that are inside of them. Ah. Ah. My jumping's not so good. Okay, I'm going to try one more time, and if I fail again, that didn't count. If I fail again, I'll just pause until I get up there. Ooh. There we go. Got it that time. Okay. So bounce off this guy, and then we make it over. I cheated. Sometimes the top of the level, you can sneak your way through. Okay. Now, these things you can actually stand on. They're just a little hard to jump to from the edge. That's why I didn't do it right away. Now, get this. Okay. Yeah, luckily it always keeps a tally of how many are left. Now, luckily we're in Dimension 4, so all those hands are gone, as you probably noticed. But any Dimension past 5, and you should expect them. And try not to forget, even though I forget all the time that they're there. Okay, just need two more. Ah, there they are. Okay. Oh, and because I passed the halfway point, because I passed that checkpoint, it'll now be in Dimension 4. It always starts you at the halfway point, even if you go backwards. And it starts you in whatever dimension you were in. So now I'll just finish the level. And that was Dim and that was World 4. We actually have four more levels to go, but they get successfully harder, so look forward to it.